The Institute of Development Studies has had a Newton Institutional Links grant with the University of Pernambuco in Brazil and Fia Cruz to explore some of the social and political dimensions of the Zika epidemic um, in Brazil. Now this, um, the reason we were interested at, at IDS in pursuing this opportunity was precisely because we've been doing a lot of work on the political economy of um, epidemics at IDS, particularly epidemics that, that have this, this outbreak potential. Um, and um, we've been particularly involved in the um, work the social science perspectives on the Ebola epidemic in West Africa. So when very unexpectedly there was an outbreak um, in Brazil um, linked to this vector-borne disease, we um, decided it was a really good opportunity and, and precisely because when um, Zika emerged in Brazil, Brazil it became really evident that it seemed that in particularly um, women living in, in vulnerable communities, low-income urban settlements with limited access to water and sanitation were the ones that were most affected. And this really um, was a parallel with some of the issues that arose in the Ebola epidemic around um, um, populations that were um, conflict-affected or marginalised who had um, weak health systems and so forth who were most vulnerable. Interestingly, in Brazil, of course, they um, is a is a national health service and that provided quite an interesting angle in the Brazil case to link particularly to Alex Shanklin's very interesting work on um, accountability in the Brazilian health system and, and the links between um, health and social care in a context like Brazil. So um, this whole project then became conceptualized around um, understanding in particular the state citizen relations in the context of, of Brazil, these uh, aspects of, of structural violence related um, to the epidemic and having these, these axes of work that on the one hand looked at, at state level processes and engagement with citizens and on the other hand explored very much the experience of women. We've um, now had a workshop um, at the conclusion of the grant and identified many fascinating themes that have come out of the work and um, we've um, been asking these the Brazilian researchers in particular to talk about those those themes in the work related to, to matters around gender and abortion, disability, care, um, the role of brokers and intermediaries in, in helping women access um, services and so th we, we're very excited about this this work and even as the epidemic has peaked in, in Brazil these kinds of issues remain particularly around how women are going to what kind of access to care they're going to get in the longer term for these children who, who have um, neurological disability.